Hey guys, Gizmo Turtle here, and today I'm bringing you guys my first ever uh, impression and reaction to the new god Susanoo and Smite. Now, I know basically nothing about this god, right? I read his moves once and I didn't quite understand him. So the whole point of this is mainly for me, but if you guys can like learn something from this, then that'd be awesome, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the abilities, and then I'm going to make a build, and then I'm going to find out what, and I'm going to put in my own opinion whether or not he's good or not, right? Now, just off the start, let's go through his abilities. Now, his passive is Swift as a Summer Storm. For each trained ability that is on cooldown, Susano gains bonus movement speed. Now, what this means is if I do all my abilities, right, like including my ult, and I go really fast. I go a lot faster than I would like normally be able to. So now this is a good escape tool, this is good like catching up the people tool. It's pretty good. It goes to 423 movement speed max. That's really good without any items. Right? Now my one my one is Storm Kata. I don't know if that's how you're supposed to say it or not, but that's what it says. Now Susano moves thrice in quick succession. After each attack, he has up to 3 seconds to fire the next one. Now, the first attack, hold on, is attacks all enemies in a cone. Second attack attacks all enemies in a circle. Third attack, you just dash forward. I don't think that's really an attack. Now, let's look at it. On Odin bot here. Now, my cone, my huge AoE circle, and my dash. Now, that was a really big AoE circle the first time, right? That, that thing covered like, hold on, let's see if we can get a better look at it. The cone, normal size, the huge AoE circle, and the dash that doesn't do damage. Now, AoE circle was like about three Odins long. That was pretty big. Now, let's go on to the second ability, Wind Siphon. Susano commands the winds to blow, dealing damage in a cone in front of him. Enemies in the center of the attack are pulled towards him. Oh, this is like Nemesis' indicator for her, uh... For slice and dice. All right, that's cool. So now I don't think Odin is really affected by CC at all. So I don't think I can pull him. But I know I can pull Ra. So let's bring him over here. Right, get near me, bud. So yeah, I guess you just pull people towards you for like a couple of autos, and you can do your one and dash through him. All right, that's cool. Now, can you leave me alone, robot? Please. Please. All right, whatever. I guess not. So now let's take a look at my three. My three is Jet Stream. Susuno throws forward a gust of air which creates a whirlwind dealing damage every 0.75 seconds for three seconds. He may activate this ability again to teleport into the whirlwind. If the initial if the initial gust hits an enemy, the whirlwind surrounds and travels with them, and teleporting to the enemy reduces this cooldown to six seconds. What? I guess we'll just do the ability. Oh, it's a dot? Okay, and then if I press 3 again, I teleport to him. Alright, this is like Hunbat's monkey then. Alright, I understand, I understand. Alright, now no, screw off, blah blah. Alright, now let's look at my ultimate, the one we're all waiting for. Susano summons a, hur a hurricane. That looks like a tornado, not a hurricane. What the heck? At his location, that pulls enemies towards the center while growing up to twice its size. Susano may activate this ability again to launch the storm in the direction he is facing, knocking up opponents in his path. Okay, so it's a charge ability that goes everywhere. Wherever I'm looking, yo, you can juke people out with that. Holy crap, damage! This is with no items, by the way. It brought him down that low. That's 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 that'll be huge in a team fight, right? Alright, that ability is pretty cool. Now, I'm going to make a build real quick to show you guys like what I think would happen. Now, to me, it doesn't seem like he would use his auto attack a lot. So I'm going to go more of like a more damage oriented build than crit, per se. So let's go into Warrior Tab by. Because I don't really find Ninja Tab by that useful with that little attack speed. Now, Jun's Wrath cause for the CDR and uh, mana. Um, Bulwark of Hope. For the magical protection health and the awesome like shield passive. Now we'll go into a Masamune. Because it gives you more movement speed, 50 power, and you deal more damage to like tanks and people that have more health than you, right? So that's really good. 
Also, we'll probably want to stack on more pen, so Titan's Bane will be good. And since we're going against Robot, we'll put on even more pen with and uh, we'll reduce his healing with Brawler's Beat Stick, so I'll be amazing. Alright, now let's see how we do against Robot with no items, by the way. This is just flat health. Flat health with base protections. So the cone, the circle, and the dash of Dundu damage. And he killed himself, that's awesome. The item just kill himself, not kill him. Alright, so so how would we do this? We do our three on him first. And we teleport to him. And we do our two. And I'm blinded. And we just kill him. We kill him with our whole kit. No ult necessary. Alright, that's pretty awesome. So let's charge the ultimate when he gets here. And he gets hit. And then we teleport to him. And then we just one him. Alright, this guy does a lot of damage. <laughs> I like his kit. I actually truly like his kit. This is probably one of my favorite assassin kits in a long time. Well, uh, yeah, I guess on my opinion on him, whether he's good or not, I would say, yeah, he's pretty good. He may be a little bit too good, so he may receive a nerf in the future. I don't know. I'll try him out in some normal games, but yeah. Well, this is my first impression, you guys. Um, about my god guides, uh, I've been doing, have been having a lot of school lately. I've been needing to do finals, so yeah, my life has gone in the way. I will, I will get to it soon. Don't worry. So if you guys want to know when that comes out, just subscribe. And uh, thank you guys for watching. This is Gizmo Turtle, and I'm signing off.